320 soldiers who are members of the United Nations Interim Force in Lebanon, or UNIFIL, Garuda Contingent Task Force, or Conga Chalk 3, have officially fulfilled their peace mission in Lebanon. And after carrying out a peace mission for one year, the soldiers were welcomed directly by the Indonesian Armed Forces Peacekeeping Center, or PMPP Commander, at the Sukarno Hatta Airport. 320 members of the Indonesian Garuda contingent have returned home from a year of peacekeeping mission in Lebanon. Commander of the Armed Forces Peacekeeping Center, Rear Admiral Retiano Punto, presided over the welcome ceremony at the Sukarno Hatta Airport on Saturday night with family members also attending. The arrival marked the last batch of outgoing peacekeepers serving in Lebanon totaling 1,089 personnel. Today, uh, we already, I mean, uh, seen that uh, the last chalk of uh, Indonesian contingent rotation already arrived uh, in uh, Cengkareng uh, Airport. Uh, here is uh, the last chalk is total number uh, 320 uh, personnel. From the total of uh, outgoing uh, contingents, 1,089 uh, personnel of uh, uh, Garuda contingents uh, from uh, Unifil Lebanon. They had faced numerous challenges when serving, especially with tension from the Israeli Hamas war spilling into Lebanon as well. The challenge is uh, this uh, big number, so we have to manage uh, well in order to fulfill uh, the timeline and also the handover process uh, in uh, mission area. So, as we know that uh, the tension in uh, Unifil mission area is uh, very, yeah? sometimes uh, the tension is very high and sometimes it's uh, getting lower. Myself. I am as uh, Indonesian uh, Armed Forces Peacekeeping Center, Rear uh, Admiral Retiono, and also my deputy, uh, the Brigadier General Dodi. Uh, we just returned back from the uh, mission area. So I can conclude that the situation is uh, very. The commandant of a task force of the each uh, contingents, uh, they have to observe yeah, the escalation and then uh, anticipate yeah, what they, they should do uh, in order to minimize and to accomplish uh, their mission in UNIFIL. Happiness and relief were the prevailing mood that day, something that many of the personnel couldn't quite hidden. I'm very happy. I'm very happy after meet my, my, my wife, my kids, Samuel and Angelica. Okay. After this, uh, we, will, we will be back uh, to the normal life. Report to our its, uh, headquarters, Navy, Air Force, and also uh, Army. Of course, we are feel very happy. We can meet again with our family, our friends in Indonesia. After this, of course, we will be uh, waiting for the new order. So it will be, uh, will be holiday or we are waiting for another? I really want to get holiday with my family. Really, I really want to go with them and spend my time with them after I finish this mission one year. However, there are some administrative procedures they would have to undergo before they could go home and join their families including medical exams. Uh, welcome back in Indonesia, okay? uh, but please be patient because they have to follow the procedure, yeah? a medical check, administrative thing, and then also, uh, uh, I mean, the military police will check, I mean, their luggage and everything. So everything, if it is clear, and then uh, I hope that they can, I mean, uh, meet their family happily. And then for my troops on the ground, I mean the mission, I just say, please maintain our vision as a prima yeah, 
prima peacekeeper prima min profesional responsif integratif modern and adaptive of Indonesian peacekeeper Indonesia's involvement in peacekeeping missions through the Garuda contingent is a part of its commitment to realizing world peace, a commitment enshrined in the Constitution. Arif Subakti, Ferry Ahmad, for C Today.